Of course, today, as we mentioned, is the first day of winter, and if you happen to be heading out of town, you'll definitely want to prepare yourself because roads can definitely get slick. KTSM 9 News reporter Jasmine Perry joins us live to tell us the ins and outs of preparing your vehicle as the temperatures drop during the holidays. Jasmine, good morning and happy first day of winter to you. Good morning, Trevor, and happy first day of winter, of course. So AAA says they're expecting 9 million Texans to travel 50 miles or more this Christmas. And with travel safety tips and as well as getting your vehicle inspected ahead of time, it will have you driving safely to your destination. As AAA likes to say, make a good bet, you'll arrive safely. And by that, they mean check your battery engine and tires. AAA spokesperson Joshua Zuber says and make sure to check your battery if it's older than three years as well as your engine plus the pressure on your tires and tread. Zuber says a really way a really easy way to check the tread is by flipping a quarter upside down. If there is any space between Washington's head and the tread that means it's time to change your tires. He advises always have an emergency safety kit as this comes in handy if you're traveling far. Uh, that should have a cell phone charger, a first aid kit. Check the expiration on the first aid kit if you already have one. Uh, bring extra blankets, hats, warm gloves, um, you know, uh, plenty of drinking water and non-perishable snacks for passengers, including pets. Um, bring a flashlight with extra batteries, reflective warning triangles, and an ice scraper or snow brush. As temperatures keep dropping in the borderland, Zuber says it's always a good idea to have chains for your tires, just in case, especially if you're traveling towards the East Coast during the holiday period. Adding that if you have a trusted technician, prepare your vehicle ahead of time and not wait till last minute. AAA also has a free service that you can that anybody can use, and that is the Triple Approved Auto Repair Facility Network, and you can find that link when you click on my story at ktsm.com. I'm Jasmine Perry, KTSM 9 News. Jasmine, thank you so much.